He's done it. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Hockey Talkie. My name is Clay. Thank you for tuning in. This is just going to be a quick little video here. I want to touch on the exciting news that came out today. A number of former players getting the call from Lanny McDonald being notified that they would be included in the Hockey Hall of Fame's class of 2020, meaning they will be inducted into the Hall of Fame later this year. And two of those players just happen to be former Blackhawks players, including the demigod Marion Hossa, as well as former defensive great Doug Wilson. Now, Doug has had to wait quite a while. He's been eligible for the Hockey Hall of Fame since the mid-90s. And for a guy who's played over a thousand games, who has won a Norris Trophy, and is, you know, just the leading defensive scorer in Blackhawks franchise history, it's crazy that it's taken this long for him to get into Hockey Hall of Fame. But nonetheless, he is now officially going to be a Hockey Hall of Fame member. Uh, Well-deserved for him. He's the type of player that easily could have his number retired by the Blackhawks if the Blackhawks choose to. Whether that happens remains to be seen, but if they decide to do that, like, it would be totally legit. There would be no complaints for him, anyone. He was that good of a player. On the flip side, you have Marion Hosa, who uh, didn't have to wait long at all. This was his first chance to be eligible for the Hockey Hall of Fame, and it just so happens that Marion Hosa is officially a first ballot Hall of Famer. Now, some people may complain that he doesn't have any individual awards, and, and that's true, but he has won three Stanley Cups, and well, then you might complain that he's been playing with three future Hall of Famers on those teams, and Jonathan Taves, Patrick Kane, and Duncan Keith. Well, I would argue that Marion Hosa was the most valuable out of all of those players for those cup runs. He didn't win the Conn Smythe at all, but his 200-foot game, his puck possession, like, he was the complete player. The Blackhawks certainly do not win any cups without Marion Hosa, that is for sure. You could probably say that about any of the other players, but Marion Hosa especially. He's played over 1,000 games. He's scored over 1,000 points. Uh, he just was the complete player, 200-foot game, uh, just won puck battles, just kept possession. I mean, just everything. Like, he was so much po more than just the point totals that he put up. And he put up a lot of points. It was pretty nuts. And he put up some big points in the playoffs, too. So, great news to see both Marion Hossa and Doug Wilson getting the nod this year to be included, to be inducted into the Hockey Hall of Fame. Uh, along with a number of other really great players. I'm not really going to touch on all those other players or controversies or snubs or whatever, but I do know for sure that these two players, these two Blackhawks, uh, definitely deserve it. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments section below. Like, share, and subscribe. Appreciate that as always. But most importantly, stay safe, make good decisions, and I'll see you next time.